Welcome back. So now let us go and take a look at the agenda and the points that we are going to cover in this program. So we'll be discussing the brief of all the points one by one and then of course we'll be going in detail with all the points. The first of the point is we need to know who actually the digital natives are. The definitions of the digital natives and on top of that how exactly the digital natives are categorized. What are the key points, the limitations, are the elements that make a human being categorized as a digital native. Furthermore, we'll be proceeding further with the information age mindset. What information age has brought to us and how it has affected the digital natives. And now, what challenges that affect has brought for the teaching professionals and how they are going to take care of it. We are going to go for a comparison between the digital natives and the digital immigrants. We'll be discussing about their psychology on different levels, their responses to different situations, their observations, and what actually makes them different from each other, and how exactly the gaps between the both categories have started taking place. We'll be moving to another concept, how exactly the habits are developed and why this information can be very helpful for the teaching professionals to develop their own habits to make it convenient for the digital natives to understand them better and to deliver whatever they want in a more effective way. Then we'll be proceeding further with the roles of the modern age institutions, how they exactly can make it convenient for their teaching professionals to become better and get in a good connection with the digital natives by learning them. And finally, the role of the teachers themselves, what they should do, what they should stop doing, and how they are going to approach the digital natives and this whole educational paradigm. So we'll be proceeding further with our introduction of the digital natives. Thanks a lot.